Guys, it's about to get real. This is fun. Get real. I think it's been pretty real. <laughs> oh, it's about to get real. Okay, get more. It's about to get a little bit different. experience here. It blew these two four by eight sheets of plywood all the way from the side. Almost hit Jonathan. But guess what's still on? The roof. The roof! <laughs> Seriously, that was crazy. I've never seen anything like that. Now I gotta go make sure everything's fine. Yeah. Hey, the grill didn't flip over. I was a little worried about it. You should have seen nine nine. Oh my gosh. Was he having the time he was of his life? Loving it. I couldn't even see him. <laughs> So much dust over there. I couldn't see very far in front of me. Even like I, I knew Adelaide was up there chasing it, but I couldn't see him. Yeah. That was crazy. So this is a bummer. There's a little bracket on our fence charger and this little solar panel attached to it. You can see right there, that wind just ripped it off. So we had to take it off of, we had it mounted up here. So we're gonna have to figure out some way to remount this panel to this box so that we can turn it back on again. We just turned it off for now, but geez some crazy wind. You wonder why we keep our solar panels just laying down all the time. I just gave up trying to keep them up and putting them down before the wind came because it comes out of nowhere. So now we just lay them down. Everything's okay. Alright guys, another day, another day of cob. More cob. Oh. So much cob. We're gonna start on the south side wall and try to get a good layer up, let that dry, move to the north side. See, we kind of started up here. We want to go up as high as we can to that decking, but it's too tall to do in one shot. So we're going to do the first layer and then go back to the back because we haven't quite finished that. That north side, man. It's I feel like we've time. been doing the north side for like <laughs> three weeks. That's okay. I think today's the day. <sighs> I think it might get done today. Okay, so we're going to work on the south side and then we're going to go to the coffee shop and then we're gonna come back and finish the north side. You didn't side. tell me that part. Oh yeah. Coffee shop on the weekends. All right. That's what we do. All right. Ready, set, go. Round one is done. 
quick break and we are headed back to the <laughs> Ada. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, after a quick break, we're headed back to the north side of the building and we're gonna finally get it completely closed in. And then we're gonna come back to the south side if we have time and get another coat up there. Ready? We're going to put in one more layer on the south side. Probably won't get all the way up to the decking, but we're going to be really close. The other side is done. Look at that. Finally. Can we say finally? Let's say finally. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Guys, we finally closed in the north wall. Yes, it's about dang time. Well, I think we've been saying this for several videos. That was a lot more cob than we thought. Yeah, it's I a big think. space. And we had to fill up on both sides of the LVL. And so that ended up being, you know, probably about this much on each side. Four or five inches. All the way up, yeah. Then up to the rafters. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway, it was a lot of cob. That's but exciting. It's done. Yeah, it feels really good to have that done. And we are nearly closed in already on the south, on side. The south side. And you got all the straps covered up yeah. on the south side too. Yep. So moving right along then. We're moving along. We're feeling feeling pretty good. Mm -hmm. Feeling like we're making some actual progress now. Yeah. It felt really good to have a whole day like dedicated to that. Yeah. So yeah. So we're hoping that tomorrow. We'll get the rest of the decking, or get the rest of it filled up to the decking, and we'll be closed in. Yes, other than the little space above the window frames and lentils. Right, and we might, we haven't decided how we're going to fill that in yet. Yeah, but. but the majority of everything that we need, closed in, which means finishing the outside of the bags. It also means we get to do some other stuff, like Go install some inside. windows, maybe Electric. run some electrical. Guys, it's about to get real. This is fun. Get real. I think it's been pretty real. <laughs> oh, it's about to get real. Okay, get more. It's about to get a little bit different and more interesting. Yes. I'm excited for when we get the whole first coat on the outside of the building. We may just move right on into the inside and wait on our final coats for the outside. That way yeah. we can get the cob finished on the inside. Get the floor done. And get the floor done. And then like start like moving some stuff in yeah we could always like do the outside last also the biggest consideration is that we have got to get the power set up because mm. it is getting hotter and hotter yeah. it's been almost 90 every day all yeah. week and it would be miserable to go a whole another summer without air conditioner yeah. and the airstream so so if we can move to the inside and get to the point where we feel like we have an enclosed space inside that we can start installing that stuff we're not waiting on like finishing the walls then we can kind of put that as a priority and then finish up the outside later yeah maybe unless we start getting monsoons and then we start having problems with like tearing up the outside wall which could be a thing yeah but i kind of so doubt we'll, we'll have it <laughs> we'll have to see what happens we're just we're gonna have to keep an eye on it so yeah anyway 
Long story short, <laughs> we got a lot done. We're rambling. And we are going to get more done tomorrow. Sounds good to me. of cobbing with John and Ashley. More cob. But before we get to the cob, we gotta install this because we forgot to add some power. <laughs> Many moons ago, we installed all our electrical boxes in the places that we wanted them. Uh -huh. But we forgot about one of them. I had the cleat made and everything. Uh huh but we just forgot to install it. it. It's gonna go, the reason we forgot is because it's up higher than mm -hmm. all the other plugs. So it wasn't installed at the same time. It's for a TV that's gonna be in the circle area. And so we needed it up higher. Yeah. So we're gonna improvise and we're going to put it on top of, what, what are we gonna it's call like a that shelf. wall? A ledge. The a ledge, shelf. the ledge, the circle part that doesn't go all the way up to the roof. Yeah, the ledge. Yeah. So we're going to put it on top of that and then just build our ledge up just a little bit more mm -hmm. to get above that. Mm -hmm. And also you had a great idea that instead of running all of our Romex cable through the conduit in the wall, we could also run a few on top of that ledge and then just mm -hmm. cob it in. Yep. So we're going to adjust those electrical plans just a little bit. Yeah. For now, we're going to throw that in. Oh, and also internet conduit. Yes, we almost forgot. We were we were thinking, oh, we're going to finish going up to the top today. And then uh, we were like, Adelaide says, you forgot to run the conduit. Yeah. So yep, we we need, we're going to run two pieces of conduit just in case because we don't really know how Internet's going to change in the future. Do you want to have one on the other side just in case? Mm, not really. Okay. I don't think. I mean... There's no, you can cover it up if you don't need it. Yeah, but I, I think we need to have a couple of pieces of conduit that will allow us to snake a cable out to an external antenna okay. and probably multiple antennas. There will be Wi-Fi and some sort of cell boosting situation. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we got to put those in so that we can run those wires through when we need. Now, I don't think those wires are going to be cobbed over, though. I don't think. Because those wires could totally change in the future. Power wires aren't going to change, but Internet cables could always change. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> For now, we're just putting the conduit in. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so, that's what we're doing. That was a long explanation. It was. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's go put this in and get to coughing. But also the conduit. Did you already cut that? No, we gotta measure. Okay. We gotta measure first. Let's go, guys. Measure thrice, cut once. Okay. <laughs> I just blew that right in my face. Don't blow it this way. I'm not. I'm getting hit. Okay. So, like that. Probably. I think it needs to stick off a little bit.
bit. Huh. This is very exciting. <laughs> we actually finished closing it in. Well, you know that tomorrow it's going to separate, and we'll have to do a little bit of crack work. True. But basically, but it's closed in. Basically, we're closed in. I know. Which is a huge milestone. Yeah. And you know what else? What? I'm putting a layer on the inside right here. Hold on, hold on. What are you doing? Well, we're thinking about putting windows in this week. That's true. So I'm just, I want to see what it's going to look like. Can you see it? I don't know. <laughs> I got it as far out as I can. Look at it. <sighs> Covering up the straps. Yes. Can't even tell they're there. Yes. Get it, Nine-Nine. Okay, that is it for today. We are so excited because we are closed in. We are closed in. Yeah, that all is, the way around. I feel like we've been dreaming of this day since as soon as we got the roof on. Yeah, because we we got the roof on and we were very excited about that, and then we realized, oh, we have all this space. <laughs> we kind of fill in. Well, you know, when, before we got started, we were thinking, oh my gosh, this is going to take so long. It really wasn't that long. In the we game. need to look and see how long it took because... We'll just pop it up on the screen. Yeah, we'll figure it out and we'll let you know. But it feels like it's been three weeks or so. I'd say it's been two. Now, technically we aren't like finished finished, but we're, we've taken the wall from the top of the bag all the way up to the decking, all the way around. It may not be quite as thick as it needs to be everywhere. Right, because remember, we aren't going as thick as we need to be on the inside because our ceiling will come in and then we're going to cob up to the ceiling. Right, so we've intentionally left that further back. And even on the outside, there may need There's to be There's a few, some, yeah, like yeah. cosmetic things that need to be smoothed out. Right. But, but it is sealed up. That means we're moving away from the sort of building large chunks of cob stage to the surface stage so that means like a That's thinner, some more fun stuff right yeah and it goes a lot faster something that all the kids enjoy yeah so yeah yeah i bet we're gonna get done with the outside this week can i just say that can it happen <laughs> we can certainly try our best yeah i th i mean maybe i think it's doable yeah Anyway. anyway, gosh, we get on these rambling no, no. tangents. And Listen, then... guys, here's the thing. Cobb uses so much water. Yeah. Like, so much water. We've been blowing through how much water we usually use for the month. And so yeah. that's what we have to go do right now. We have to do some water runs, put some more water back in our big storage tank so we can keep making Cobb. Oh, hey, 9-9. Nine 9-9, nine. Nine nine, it's just dirt. You'll be okay. <laughs> anyway, we got to do water runs. So... That's it for today, right? Yeah. Yeah? We will see you next on the time. next time. <laughs> on the next <laughs> time. All night long, diamonds are all I see. And they'll always be here, but never bright enough for me. You light up my world. 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 Yeah. Turning down the politics, hey, hey. and I ain't always an optimist. Yeah. But I'm trying to live, I'm trying to live. Great little light of mine, I'ma let it shine. shine. I can feel the vibes as they entwine. Oh, you know I'm lit, it's a thin line. Whoa. But you can't turn this off, I'm shining from inside. I, I had dark days, the only thing I felt was pain. Ain't no sun rays, the only thing they left was rain. Life's perfect, that's something that I will never say.